do this video now because I haven't touched a bike yet so I can record it the way it is before I fix it all. So I got hit by a car today, but it's not that big of a deal. It was just a side swipe and he was a work colleague and I just don't give a shit. All he did was hit my license plate and, and um, scratch my paint here, which so sucks, you know, oh, I'm, you know, this, that sucks. But other than that, it's just paint. Could have been a lot worse. What happens is whenever I merge into a highway, you know, you like you look left, you look right, and you know, and then he turned left. Um, I always, generally, always, probably ninety percent of the time, stop my vehicle and then turn left, because you never know if someone's going to surprise you and hit you. So um, I pulled my bike over into the little corner, which is where I always hide, so I don't get rear-ended. You can't really get rear-ended because I'm going around the corner and I stop there, and then I wait for traffic. <laughs> I can see why it's misleading. So I went around the corner and stopped behind a line, and my work colleague must have thought I was continuing. So then he side-scraped my bike, and he bent my license plate, but he side-scraped my bike and um, pushed, and, and, and really he knocked me over. Um, my, my shifter's bent. I'll just have to unbend that, that's easy. Get a hammer and knock the um, foldable peg out, they fold for a reason. And my lever's not exactly straight, but I, I can probably fix that. And um, my clip-on's just been pushed inwards, it's not exactly like a triangle anymore or whatever. It's all fixable, there's no harm, no foul, I just told him you know, don't worry about it. He was pretty shaken up and worried. Well, not shaken up, but he was pretty concerned. And, you know, he, you know, he's like, you know, we'll exchange information and all that shit. But there was no point. It's, I'll fix it up in literally like, I don't know, to bend something out. It takes me like two, two minutes to bend the lever out. That might be a little bit different. I'll get, a, I'll get an open ender and bend it upwards. And then that's it. That's it. I mean, the only thing I really have to do is... Stick a sticker over here, maybe, and cover that up, and um, be mint, be like nothing happened. So yeah, look at my work colleagues watching this. Don't worry, bro. There's no hard, no feelings. No, no, no you know, no one got hurt. The only, the only thing I got is a little scrape on my leg. I don't know what caused that. Probably the, probably the five glass, to be honest. But there's no harm, no foul. Everything I've done. I can get fixed. Your car has a big giant white scratch down the door, so good luck fixing that. We could probably buff it out, to be honest. But, um, look, no harm, no foul. Also, apparently, um, my boss sideswiped someone today as well and did quite a bit, bit of damage. We don't know, we're unsure. He says he never heard anything, never felt anything. But the pigs rang him up and said that he hit a car. So I guess it's not the, um, I don't want to say the company's name, but I guess it's not my, my boss's company's day. I hope Ash rides home safe. <clears throat> but um, don't worry, uh, don't worry mate, I won't be telling Dave about this. I don't really care. I might tell him in a month or two, but I won't tell him now. None of his business. Um, the only people I'm telling is my best friend. They are one guy. Not the so-called best friend. I love you, love you, duck. But I'll be telling my R1 guy. But um, no, I just have to to um, bend my. Yeah, it's pretty. See, it like completely hits my. Yeah, I just you know. But yeah, it's all just got a 13 millimeter. Fix that up. Done. Anyway, um, I don't know what else will be happening today, so I might make a part two. But the bike's mint. The bike's still good. Stick a sticker over there. I don't know what kind, but I'll find one. And I will call it even. <sighs> I know you're going to feel really bad, mate. But don't worry about it. Honestly, every day is a good day. This is why I say every day is a good day. Every day is a good day, mate. Never a bad day. I got sideswiped. I probably had my first motorbike accident while on the road, which involved another car. And I'm glad it was you. I'm glad it was you, you know? It wasn't a stranger. It was a person I know, it was very minimal. If I like stopped in the middle of the road, you could have rear-ended me properly. So, you know, so like, 
you know, it was it was great. Every day is a good day. There could have been a lot worse outcomes. I'm very happy with this outcome. Plus, look, gives a little bit more character. You know, now I can say to all the cheerleaders, I was racing the bike and it got dropped. You know, it got dropped here and it got dropped here when I was racing, you know, and people wouldn't know the difference because it sort of lines up, you know. Ah, don't worry about it, man. Every day is a good day. You look after yourself. Don't worry about today, okay? Um, shit happens. Just buy me some Pokemon cards or buy me a drink or, you know, just you, you'll figure something out. Don't worry, bro. Look after yourself and uh, love you, man. And all the other people I send this to, which will be Duck and R1 Mate and a few other people. The bike's fine. Nothing's wrong with it. I mean, it needs a bigger motor. The, two, the 250, 300, whatever, you know, it's fun, the CB. Maybe put a 600 in it now. Might be a bit better.